Damari is an endangered Indic language, spoken by older Dom people scattered across the Middle East and North Africa. The language is reported to be spoken as far north as Azerbaijan and as far south as central Sudan, in Turkey, Iran, Iraq, Palestine, Israel, Jordan, Egypt, Sudan, Libya, Tunisia, Algeria, Morocco, Syria and Lebanon. Based on the systematicity of sound changes, we know with a fair degree of certainty that the names Damari and Romani derive from the Indic word Dom. The language itself actually derives from an Indo-Aryan language. It shares many similarities to Punjabi and Rajasthani, two languages that originated in India. The Arabs referred to them as Nawar as they were a nomadic people that originally immigrated to the Middle East from India. Damari is also known as Middle Eastern Romani, Sajin, Luti, or Metar. There is no standard written form. In the Arab world, it is occasionally written using the Arabic script and has many Arabic and Persian loanwords. Descriptive work was done by Yaran Matras, who published a comprehensive grammar of the language along with an historical and dialectological evaluation of secondary sources Matras 2012. Damari is an endangered language and is currently being shifted away from in younger generations, according to Yaran Matras. In certain areas such as Jerusalem, only about 20% of these Dom people, known as Middle Eastern Gypsies, speak the Damari language in everyday interactions. The language is mainly spoken by the elderly in the Jerusalem community. The younger generation are more influenced by Arabic, therefore most only know basic words and phrases. The modern-day community of Doms in Jerusalem was established by the nomadic people deciding to settle inside the old city from 1940 until it came under Israeli administration in 1967 1999. Dialects The best known variety of Damari is Palestinian Damari, also known as Syrian Gypsy, the dialect of the Dom community of Jerusalem, which was described by R. A. S. McAllister in the 1910s. Palestinian Damari is an endangered language, with fewer than 200 speakers, the majority of the 1,200 members of the Jerusalem Damari community being native speakers of Palestinian Arabic. Other dialects include Nawari in Syria, Jordan, Lebanon, Israel, Palestine and Egypt. Kurbati in Syria and western Iran Halabi in Egypt, Libya, Tunisia, Algeria and Morocco Halab, Gahar in Sudan. Karachi in northern Turkey, northern Iran and the Caucasus Marashi in Turkey Baraki in Syria Churi Wali in Afghanistan, Nurakorava in southern India. Some dialects may be highly divergent and not mutually intelligible. Published sources often lump together dialects of Damari and the various unrelated in group vocabularies of diverse peripatetic populations in the Middle East. Thus, there is no evidence at all that the Lyali, for example, speak a dialect of Damari, not is there any obvious connection between Damari and the vocabulary used by the Helebi of Egypt. See discussion in Matras 2012, Chapter 1. The small Seb Selyar language of Iran is distinctive in its core vocabulary. Status <laughs> 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 Jerusalem Damari is fluently spoken only among the elder generation in the Dom community. These nomadic people have been bilingual for many generations, however recently there has been a language shift towards the dominant geographic language, Arabic. In the 1940s, the Dom began to abandon their nomadic culture and began settling and working in the local economy. This led to the next phenomenon, the assimilation of Dom children in the primary school system which marked the first generation to grow up in an academic environment alongside Arab children. Consequently, this 1940 generation do not fluently speak the Damari language. Arabic replaced their native Damari and became the language of cross-generation communication. In Jerusalem, it is estimated that there are about 600 to 900 members of the Dom population in Jerusalem. Less than 10% can effectively communicate in Jerusalem Damari. Topic: <laughs> Comparison with Romani. Damari was once thought to be the sister language 
of Romani, the two languages having split after the departure from the Indian subcontinent, but more recent research suggests that the differences between them are significant enough to treat them as two separate languages within the central zone Hindustani group of languages. The Dom and the Ram are therefore likely to be descendants of two different migration waves out of India, separated by several centuries. There are nevertheless remarkable similarities between the two beyond their shared central zone Indic origin, indicating a period of shared history as itinerant populations in the Middle East. These include shared archaisms that have been lost in the central Indo-Aryan languages over the millennium since Dom – Ram emigration, a series of innovations connecting them with the northwestern zone group, indicating their route of migration out of India, and finally a number of radical syntactical changes due to superstrate influence of Middle Eastern languages, including Persian, Arabic and Byzantine Greek. Orthography. <laughs> <laughs> Since Damari is a minority Middle Eastern language for a specific community of speakers, it did not have a standard orthography for many years, therefore many writers have used differing spelling systems similarly to what happened with Ladino. Most Middle Easterners used the Arabic script, while scholars made do with a modified pan vilak Latin based alphabet. <laughs> modified pan vilak orthography In 2012, Yaron Matras used such a system in his recent publications on this subject where the pan Vilak orthography served as a basis, with several modifications Romani J changed to Y Romani C used limited to the accented form C for T, the D counterpart being denoted by Ds Doubled vowel letters for long vowels I -E -U -U -U. Diphthongs denoted with vowel pairs I -O -A -E -U -Oy, and so on Additional letters in use for Semitic derived words and names DHSTZGQ and so on. Topic Pan Damari alphabet A new Semitic flavored Latin based Pan alphabet has recently been introduced by some scholars for the purpose of codifying written Damari. The Pan Damari alphabet, which was invented in 2015, is a Semitic flavored simplification of the previous Matras notation. Y is used for J, and W for with, like in English X is used for the sound X. The well known guttural KH of Greek, Russian, and Middle Eastern languages Q stands for Q. The uvular plosive sound heard in the Semitic languages circumflexes are used to mark long vowels and certain fricative, affricate consonants equals CHGHJ shish ZH underdose under letters represent pharyngeal ISD consonants IPA, D, H, S, T, Z. Other letters include thorn and ev for the interdental fricatives, theta, the characters aleph, hamza, IPA, and ein, IPA, and the letter for the vowel sound schwa. The diphthongs are now denoted by vowel plus approximant digraphs, greater than, the pan Damari alphabet is shown in this table, notes section spelling alternates are shown for certain of these sounds i.e., when typing on an ASCII or typewriter keyboard, or when, where computers cannot show the proper accented Damari letters, these alternates are also used on the KURI's Learn Damari article series, one the letter fe may be sounded either as a labiodental, f, or a bilabial, fricative, depending on the context, or origin of a given word, name, to the letter gi usually represents a voiced velar fricative, but may be sounded as a valerolaryngeal. In words, names derived from Arabic, Persian, and Urdu, three the letter ne usually represents a voiced dental nasal, and, however, it manifests as a velar, before the letters g g k q x, but as a palatal, before the letters c j y. For the letter re represents a flapped, or a trilled r rotative resonant continuant, depending on the position within a word, name, and whether it appears singly or doubly. 5. The letter ve shows up mainly in words and names derived from foreign loans, and may represent either a voiced labiodental, v, or a voiced bilabial, beta, fricative. 6. The letter z pronounced as k -h -e -h usually represents a voiceless velar fricative, x, but usually is sounded as a valerolaryngeal, chi, one in scores of loan words, loan names which are derived from Arabic, Persian, and Urdu. 7. The vowel letter called swa its name derives from the cognate Hebrew vowel point for this very same sound represents the mean mid-central spread neutral vowel as it exists in the English words about, taken, pencil, lemon, and circus. While its normal manifestation is indeed it may vary in the direction of either a higher mid, or a fronted lower mid, one, depending on the dialect spoken. 
Special note asterisk, the plain unaccented letters C and J are only found in foreign loan words and loan names, as shown in the above table. Phonology Vowels There are five main vowel sounds, however this inventory shows the variation and quantity of short vowels. Most are interchangeable with a vowel sound next to it, however all of the sounds produced above are identical to the local Palestinian Arabic Consonants <laughs> 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 Most of these consonants are influenced by Palestinian Arabic such as gemination, however, consonants such as p, g, t, and h are not found in the local dialect. There is speculation among linguists that these sounds are considered a part of the pre-Arabic component. Alveopalatal affricates such as t and d are also consonants that differ in sound from Arabic. Stress. The biggest difference in expression of language between Arabic and Damari is where the stress is placed. Arabic has phoneme level stress while Damari is a language of word level stress. The Damari language emphasizes stress on the final syllable, as well as grammatical markers for gender and number. Most nouns, besides proper nouns, adopted from Arabic sound distinct because of the unique stresses in Damari Damari is thought to have borrowed a lot of words and grammatical structure from Arabic, however, this is not entirely true. Complex verbs and most core prepositions did not transfer into the realms of grammar of the Damari language. The syntactic typology remains independent of Arabic influence. It also important to note that the numerals used by the Dams were inherited from Kurdish. Even though Damari was influenced by local Arabic, the language also felt the impacts of Kurdish and certain dialects of Iranian in the grammar of the language. <laughs> numerals Here is a table of the numerals 1 to 10, 20, and 100 in Hindi, Romani, Damari, Lomavran, and Persian for comparison. <laughs> 